What is creatine? You've probably heard about it in the gym or seen it on supplement shelves, but what's really going on inside your body when you take it? Creatine is a natural compound your body actually makes on its own, using amino acids, the building blocks of protein. It's produced mainly in your liver, kidneys, and pancreas, and then transported through your bloodstream to your muscles. You also get creatine from the foods you eat, especially red meat and fish. These foods are naturally rich in creatine, which is why athletes and fitness enthusiasts often pay attention to their diet as well as supplements. Once in your body, about 95% of your creatine is stored in your skeletal muscles, where it's ready to be used whenever you need a burst of energy for movement or exercise. The remaining 5% is found in your brain and other vital organs, where it also plays a role in supporting cellular energy and possibly even cognitive function. Creatine's main job is to help your body create and recycle ATP or adenosine triphosphate. ATP is like the energy currency for every cell in your body, fueling everything from muscle contractions to brain activity. During intense activity, like sprinting or lifting weights, your muscles burn through ATP in just a few seconds, which is why you can only go all out for a short burst. Here's where creatine steps in. Stored as phosphocreatine, it donates a phosphate group to ADP, rapidly regenerating ATP. This process lets you push harder, lift heavier, and recover faster between sets. Supplementing with creatine increases your muscles' stores of phosphocreatine, giving you a bigger energy reserve to draw from during high-intensity exercise. Think of it as upgrading your muscles' battery pack, so you can perform at your best for longer periods. This simple, natural process is the reason creatine is one of the most researched and effective supplements for boosting athletic performance and muscle power. In short, creatine is a safe, elegant way to power up your body, support your brain, and help you reach your fitness goals. Creatine's biggest claim to fame is boosting strength and power. Proven by hundreds of studies, it helps you train harder, leading to bigger gains in muscle and strength. Creatine also draws water into muscle cells, making them look fuller and possibly triggering more muscle growth. But it's not just for muscles. Your brain uses ATP too. Research shows creatine may improve memory, reasoning and mental speed, especially under stress or in older adults. It can also aid recovery, reduce muscle damage and help older adults maintain strength and independence. Creatine is a true all-rounder for body and mind. Who benefits most from creatine? And is it right for you? Athletes, regular gym goers, and anyone doing high-intensity training see the biggest gains in strength and performance. Older adults can use it to fight age-related muscle loss, maintain strength, and support healthy aging. Vegetarians and vegans, who get less creatine from food sources, often see even bigger improvements in muscle and energy. There's growing evidence for cognitive benefits too. Students, professionals, and anyone needing mental stamina may benefit from creatine. Creatine isn't just for bodybuilders, it's for anyone wanting to boost their physical or mental performance every day. Its appeal goes far beyond the gym, reaching people from all walks of life. Creatine is simple to use. The best form is creatine monohydrate, affordable, effective, and well-studied. You can start with a loading phase, 20G slash day for 5, 7 days, or just take 3 to 5G daily from the start. Both methods work, the key is daily consistency, even on rest days. Timing isn't critical. Take it when you'll remember like with breakfast or a post-workout shake. Mixing it with carbs or protein may help absorption, but plain water works too. Dizzolve it well to avoid grittiness. No need for fancy routines, just stick to your daily dose. It's a straightforward no-fuss supplement. Despite its well-established safety and popularity among athletes and fitness enthusiasts, creatine is still surrounded by a surprising number of persistent myths and misconceptions. Many people are hesitant to try it, often because of things they've heard at the gym or read online but let's set the record straight. The first myth is that creatine harms your kidneys. This is one of the most common concerns, and it's understandable to worry about your health. However, in healthy individuals long-term scientific studies have consistently shown no evidence of kidney damage or impaired kidney function from creatine supplementation. Doctors and researchers agree that for people without pre-existing kidney issues, creatine is safe. The second myth is that creatine causes dehydration or muscle cramps. This idea has been around for years but it simply isn't supported by research. In fact studies show that creatine may actually help your muscles retain water and improve overall hydration, especially during intense exercise. Staying hydrated is always important, but creatine doesn't increase your risk of cramps. Another common myth is that creatine causes hair loss or baldness. 
this claim is often repeated but it's not backed by solid scientific evidence. To date, no large-scale studies have shown a direct link between creatine use and hair loss. Most experts agree that this fear is unfounded for the vast majority of users. Some people also believe that creatine is a steroid or an unnatural substance. This couldn't be further from the truth. In reality, creatine is a natural compound that your body produces every day, and it's also found in foods like meat and fish. Supplementing just increases your body's natural stores. It's completely legal in all sports organizations and is not classified as a performance-enhancing drug. Coaches and athletes around the world trust it. What creatine really does is help your muscles recycle energy more efficiently, allowing you to train harder and recover faster. The science is clear. When used as directed, creatine is both safe and effective for most people, with decades of research to back it up. Don't let outdated myths or misinformation hold you back from experiencing the real benefits of creatine for your health and performance. When buying creatine, stick with pure creatine monohydrate, no need for fancy blends. Choose reputable brands with third-party testing for purity and safety. Look for certifications like NSF or Informed Sport for extra assurance. Creatine isn't a magic pill. It helps you get more from your training but you still need to put in the work. Expect a slight weight increase from water in your muscles, a sign it's working. Creatine is a proven, safe, and cost-effective supplement for strength, muscle, and even brain health. Remember, it's a supplement, not a substitute for good nutrition, training, and rest. Have you tried creatine or are you considering it? Let us know your experience.